Hey there, Racer Rob with Integrity Auto Care, and today's patient is a 1989 Chevy Camaro IROC with the 5.0 liter tuned port injection system. And customer came up with a complaint of a code 32 EGR valve, and uh, on these older systems, they're a little bit tougher to work on because it actually has the old data stream. It's OBD1 is what they call it. So what we've done here is we have the MT2500 scanner, which shows us all the data stream and codes. And if you look real close, you'll see the EGR duty percentage, the uh, cycling of the EGR port solenoid. And one thing that we ran into right away that I've never seen before is uh, we've got the intake plenum off here for you so we can get down to the EGR valve. And that bad boy has got a one wire sensor on the outside of it and there is not much information on this system so this is your EGR valve here bolts into the intake plenum and what that basically does is when it applies vacuum to it through the solenoid over here it basically opens up that EGR valve and lets exhaust gases back into the intake to reduce NOx so part of the emissions but uh, so one thing that we found out right away was that is not a sensor it's called an EGR switch and it took me many days to find information on this and this is why I'm making this video for you is because that part is very tough to get a hold of they don't make it anymore but think and even for testing so thank goodness I found this guy on the internet ChevyThunder.com that goes through a really cool diagram there where it shows you here's your EGR solenoid that the computer commands on here's your vacuum to open up the EGR valve and what that does is then it allows exhaust gases around the uh, pintle into the intake and how the computer knows that it's commanded the EGR on this is a feedback system is this EGR temperature switch that little bad boy closes when it gets hot enough and that sends a signal back to the computer that hey I've commanded my EGR on with the duty cycle a vacuum should be going to it and I want to see this switch close in a, in a matter of seconds after it's commanded that on so that's what we've noticed was this switch was stuck closed so we've got a new one on order and I just wanted to show you what that looks like so once we get that new switch in there we will test the duty cycle on the solenoid so that's this is part one of the 89 Chevy Camaro IROC with the code 32 and there you have it part two coming your way racer Rob integrity auto care over and out